happy Monday. I don't want to keep you too long today. I just want to do a quick little video. I had to go to the store really fast. This is the deal. We got to quit complaining. You know, and I throw myself in there. I try not to, but you know, we just got to quit complaining because this is the deal. You can have whatever it is you want if you're willing to put in the work. And I understand people come from trying backgrounds. I've been there myself. And it may take you longer than someone that has that silver spoon. But you know what? The silver spoon ain't always what you want. I've known people that had the silver spoon. And you know what? They're more dysfunctional than, or some of them are more dysfunctional than most of the people that I know that came from nothing. Because they got no reason to work hard. They got everything. They don't, they don't have a fire in their butt because there's no necessity there. If there's not a need there, everyone's not gonna have that level of motivation and that creativity. You want it to be hard. That's when your creative nature will start to, you know, percolate. That's when that'll start to bubble up out of the mind and you will have those great ideas come to you. You know, struggle's great. If you can handle it mentally, physically, but a lot of the time I see that people don't take care of themselves and I've been there, you know? I was a huge, enormous, fat body, eating horrible foods, acidic body, bloated inflammation, you know? I mean, it, it was bad. And once I got those kind of things under control, then I was able to focus on the mind, focus on growth focus on other areas because I'm like, you know, this health thing is covered. And you know, I still deal with it now, but it's different. It's not from a state of like, you know, desperity, can't walk down the street without my feet and my knees hurting. I mean, you know, athletic, yes, but I mean, you still have to deal with the physical issues from being big. I mean, man, it's horrible. You know, at least it was for me. Can't speak for anyone else. But stop complaining, work. Read, like I always talk about. If you don't like to read, snatch up the audio books. I know they're expensive, but you know what? And I, I like throwing these nuggets out there because not everyone knows. The Washington State Library, Snohomish County Library is the one that I use. They have a ton of uh, free audiobook access. So you can get, get audiobooks, you can download them right off the internet for free with a library membership, audiobooks, and you can walk, you can hang out at the house, you can listen to those bad boys, and you know what? You don't gotta, you know, have a brain bleed reading all these books and taking up all your time. You could drive to work, back and forth to work, or back and forth to your business, and listen to these audiobooks and grow as a person. You know, elevate your mind, open up your mind to new ideas new infrastructure, you know? The, it, it, you have endless opportunities if you get out there. I mean, hell, you know, you have the internet. My mentor always talks about how, you know, there was a time when there were the, 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 the access to these calculators wasn't there. They had to do all of it by hand and use their brain. You have Google. You can Google right now self-help. Or how, you know, learning how I learn. That's a big one. Learn how you learn. You know, are you one of these readers? Hey, if you are, great. I, you know, I can read, but I'm so busy with research and different things like that. I don't have time to read for leisure. So I like the audiobook. When I, you know, do I like to stretch my mind and put in my 15 minutes a day of reading? Yes. But I usually don't try and read for leisure outside of that. Uh, you know, I do that to keep my brain sharp for the reading that I have to do for research. But, you know, I hope those little nuggets help you. Like I said, the video went long yesterday, so I don't want to, you know, have the, the one today go very long. But stop complaining and grow. You know, don't feel sorry for yourself. You're doing great. If, 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 if you feel something, then you know that there's an issue and you know that there needs to be a change. And just remember this as I'm uh, closing the video. You attract what you feel. 
you attract what you feel. So if you feel awesome, if you feel like you can, you know, make these gains in your life, if you feel that you can be the best you, that's what's going to happen and you're going to find all these doors are going to unlock for you and you're going to have access to all the information that you need to do so. Happy Monday.